I'm going to try a little bit of bass fishing today. I'm going to go to the same lake that I've been catching my trout in in Colorado. I'm going to start off with a methylate colored worm. I'll show you what that looks like, what brand it is, and let's just go ahead and get to it. Now I'm going to start off today trying for some bass, and I'm going to use a uh, weedless wacky rig with the, I think they call that methylate color. Now I'm throwing this weightless. I'm using a 10 pound braid uh, with a eight pound fluorocarbon leader. Sun's at a really bad angle. There's a lot of vegetation out here, so we'll see what happens. Just uh, pulling it a little bit and letting it settle back to the bottom. See if I can't get their attention with that. Maybe add a twitch now and then. I think there's one looking at it. Yep. Okay. First cast. That feels like a pretty good fish, actually. Come on. Come on in. Come on. Come in. Not too bad. First first fish, first cast. Come on. Let's see. Hold on. Yeah, not too bad. I don't know what he weighs, but it's not bad. First cast, first fish. What's it in? Oh, it's just some grass. All right, tangled up in my camera or something. Okay. Healthy looking fish. Get you back in the water. See you later, buddy. Whoa. He was ready to go. Okay, let's try that again. On the methylate worm. For what it's worth, I'm using a double uni knot to tie the leader onto the braid. You can find examples of that all over YouTube. I actually saw him pick the line up. The line started moving out. Howdy. Howdy. There's one. Third cast, second fish. That feels like a good one. Come on, buddy. All right. Not too bad. Uh. 
All right. Another little, I don't know, two and a half, three pounds. Don't know. Not a bad fish, though. Get him back in the water. See you later, buddy. Man, he brought some salad with him. Man, that sun is brutal. I think something's messing with it. Or the wind's got it, I don't know. There's one. Let's see if he stays on it. Oh, looks like he dropped it. Might have been a trout or something. Nope, he's still on it. Okay. Come on, buddy. Get some pretty good shoulders on him. Bigger shoulders than I thought. We'll see what he looks like. Feeling some head shakes. Oh, come on. I want to at least get to see you. Wow. Okay, we're making some progress. I can't see in the sun. Had to come up in the sunny spot. Come on, buddy. That's a little better than the last two. Buddy, nice thank you. There we go. All right. Not sure how big this one is. Another nice one though. Get him back in the water. Okay, that's fair. Well, as you can see, I did okay on that lake. Um, the The segment of video that you saw from start to finish without the edits and everything else was only 24 minutes. So those first three pass, including getting all my camera stuff set up, were in the first, say, 15 minutes that I was there. I caught another four after that, one about the same size as the ones that you saw, and then three, well, two that were probably a pound, maybe a pound and a quarter, and then one little dink. That was it. All in all, I think it was a pretty good trip. If you like videos like this, stick around. I'll, and I'll throw one up here that I think you might like. YouTube will throw one down here that they think you might like. I'll catch you in one of those, or I'll catch you down the road.